Hey, what's up? Uh, so we're back here at uh, Phobos Rising. Uh, like I showed you before, I've got my team here. And uh, they, they consist of uh, two of these guys with the eyeball symbol. Um, that gives them bonuses to net runs, uh, which will shift this net level up which helps you out but it can also it also hurts you in a way um, it's, the, it's the number of op 4 that will attack whenever you pull an op 4 card but it's also additional die roll results uh, for mission card objective challenges um, so it's like a bonus to your mid, uh, your final mission as the higher you get that but uh, you kind of want to get that high and then hurry up and get to the mission but um, I also got a uh, soldier type character uh, gives me bonus to combat I got this guy here with the crossed wrench and hammer he's uh, gives me a bonus to uh, the repair action uh, which is basically heal healing a guy that's been flipped uh, and this guy here with the little flag symbol uh, that'll give me bonuses to, uh, to recruiting uh, leadership tests I also have a couple pieces of equipment with me. I have a, uh, a smart gun, which gives me uh, plus two to combat. And I also have a smart suit, which will give me a, uh, a bonus to uh, repair and to net runs. Um, so we begin here, and uh, my uh, movement factor is the bottom number there it's two so my team can move uh, two spaces uh, the only terrain modifiers are uh, you, you have to stop when you move into uh, an escarpment a trench a chasm or a volcano uh, otherwise I can move two hexes um, now I have the option of going over here and uh, flipping one of these or trying to anyway flip one of these installations but I'm equally close to these two installations here, the Terraformer and the Net Relay. And these sound a lot more interesting and maybe helpful to me than, uh, than this cluster over here, which is a uh, dome, uh, like a living quarters. And then there's the security headquarters and the spaceport. And uh, don't know if I really want to go mess tangle around over there yet. Uh, and then there, the other two installations are down here. They're just two domes. But, uh, so I think what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to move up to here. Uh, the terraformer there is in a chasm, so I got to stop when I move in there. But uh, I'm going to go ahead and move my team up one, two. Oh, shit. Put him here on the terraformer. And uh, the next thing we do. is we pick a, uh, a card and uh, implement the instructions in the card. So we'll pick a card and it says Sandstorms of Mars. Lose one op. If team is not in a cell with a Taz or friendly installation, roll one die for each full strength cadre and on a one flip it to its reduced side. Ouch. So I'm going to lose one op which I believe I just uh, remove a card from my uh, my deck over there. To make sure that's correct. Uh, yeah, I pick from the top of the ops card without looking. Place them with the discards face down. So I lose an op, so I take one of these, and that's my discard face down. Um, then I got to roll a dice for each of my guys, and on a one it flips. So I have what one, two, three, four, five guys. So here's the first two eyeball guys. They're safe. The military guy, he flips, of course. Of course he does. The wrench guy. Be safe, and then my final guy. He flips. Wow. 
So I got two wounded guys already there. At the uh, due to sandstorms there on Mars, and then I uh, discard this. Now uh, there would be combat if there was anybody to fight. There's not. Uh, now the uh, special actions phase. I may execute any one special action. And uh, what I'm going to try to do is flip that uh, terraformer and uh, that's going to be a, uh, a net run. So I'm going to have to do a net run uh, to see if I can flip that. Uh, let me look the rules up for that real quick and, uh, and I'll be back.